realize that, that that's how you protect yourself from these viruses. That's how you protect yourself from your enemy, man. You gotta realize these things. Read. And an adversary unto thine adversary. Most high in Christ, and an adversary unto thy adversary, man. No sweat. You got some, some, some oppressor that's trying to bully you? Some oppressor that's trying to drug you up? Some oppressor that's trying to steal your children and steal your woman? Just call Big Brother, man. Just call the Most High. Call your father and watch what he'll do for you, man. Call your father and watch how that, how that devil will drop dead, man. Watch how everything that he so-called loves and was willing to kill over it. Is willing to sell drugs to the Lord's children. Is willing to whore out the Lord's uh, daughters, man. Is willing to go to the farthest link. You understand? To get you from getting off of your culture. You understand? That's what the Lord is going to do if you obey everything that he says. Everything. Not some, not the Big Ten, but everything, man. All 600 plus law, statutes, and commandments, man. And the only way you're going to learn how to do that is behind this banner right here, man. Underneath the ISUBK. Do you understand? Read it from the top one more time. Exodus 23, verse 22. But if thou shalt indeed obey his voice uh -huh. and do all that I speak, uh -huh. then I will be an enemy unto thine enemy. Let's play big bank, take little bank, man. The Lord is going to be an enemy unto thy enemy, man. Do you understand? Let's play big bank, till, take little bank, man. America is a little bank, and the God of Israel is a big, big, big bank, man. Not just the national bank, but the bank of this entire earth. Do you understand? America don't want no smoke with the most high of this Bible, man. Not when we come back to this Bible. Nah, they don't. They don't even like the smoke corona getting from them. You understand? I said it, I said it earlier. Black people, I see a lot of black people and, and, you know, with a smile on their face right now. Because they finally getting a break from work. They, got, they finally getting a break. Their feet is finally getting a chance to relax. They back hurt a little bit less. Do you understand? They getting more family time. You understand the child is actually being able to see their father and their mother all at one time? You got to give a hand to the most high. And they're getting paid. Give a hand to the most high, man. Y'all give a hand to the most high, man. I'm loving it. The water to the most high, man. Thank you to the most high. We getting some family time now. Right here is family time. Right here is family time, what you see right now. You understand? This family time. We can't, we, we, America is going to stop playing with America. Uh, it's going to stop playing with the Most High. America learning the days. The Most High told America, hey, Shalom, brother. America, uh, uh, the Most High told America, you're going to learn the day. Do you understand? And guess what they learn in the day? It is a Saturday, and look at the sidewalks. Look at the sidewalks. Ain't no glove going to separate you from getting coronavirus, devil. Do you understand? The plane ain't no mask gonna separate you from getting that coronavirus, devil. You understand? You can layer up two, three, four masks. If the Lord wants you dead, you're dead. Do you understand? And I love it. I absolutely love it, man. Black man, enjoy your time with your children, man. Hispanic man, enjoy your time with your children, man, because guess what? When the coronavirus is gone, they're gonna continue to try to put your children in cages. So enjoy the family time, man. Enjoy the free pay. It can stop. We got to come back to this Bible right here. The Lord is ready to take off. He got the gun right here in his hand, ready to shoot it and take off. Send all of his angels to come and relieve black people out of their oppression. So it's not just family time, but it's family time all the time, man. But we got to come back to these things, man. The Lord, the scripture said, if we obey all of this, he is going to destroy our enemies, man. Drop that. Give me Exodus 14 and 14. Couple of back. Do you understand? Black people need to hear this, man. You understand? If it's, the, if it's the best thing you can do, you just got to sit and actually hear what the prophets is trying to bring out, man. What the priest is trying to bring out in this Bible, man. It's telling you right here is the blueprint right here. Black people, let me give you another example. This Bible right here, this right here is your mask, all right? This right here is your gloves right here. Do you understand? This is your Lysol, your hand sanitizer, the whole nine yards right here. This is how you protect yourself. This is the most sanitary thing you can put on your body, in your body. You understand? This is the most sanitary thing you can use, black man. That's, hey, hey. You got that scripture? I don't call. Exodus chapter 14, verse 14. The Lord shall fight for you. Oh, say that again. The Lord shall fight for you. Go ahead. And ye shall hold your peace. Black man, hold your peace. Hold your peace. That's right. 
The Lord is going to fight for you. Right. I understand you got that fire burning in your body for the bloodshed that America is doing to your loved ones, man. I understand you got that fire in your body. But understand this. The Lord said, hold your peace. I got this. I got this. Watch I hit. Hey, look. Watch I hit him with the corona. The Lord said, hold your peace. Corona is on the way. Hold your peace. Ebola is on the way. Hold your peace. A black man named Christ is on the way to bathe the streets of America in their blood, man. Hold your peace. The Lord is going to fight for you. And the Lord fight for you, black man, you ain't got to pick up a finger. All you got to do is come back to these law, statutes, and commandments. That's all you got to do is show discipline. You ain't got to punch nobody. You ain't got to kill nobody. You ain't got to go shoot up no deli. And believe me, I understand. Oppression make a wise, oppression make a wise man mad. I understand. But your fight right here is coming back to these Bibles. Fighting your lust, fighting your flesh to come back and do what the most I told you to do, man. You understand? Fight eating that shrimp crab pork and lobster, man. Fight that. You understand? It's the reason why the Lord told you to fight your lust in your flesh. You understand? It's the reason, it ain't no coincidence that America are putting these things in front of you. It ain't no coincidence America put it in everything you want to use, but no sweat. The Lord is the best at vengeance, so I'm gonna leave it to him anyway. Because he's the best at it. You getting killed in your sleep, devil, by corona. You understand? That's a beautiful thing, man. All day long, all camp long, the ISUPK is going to be giving a strong hand to the Most High for these devils dropping dead while they're walking, while they're sleeping. The whole, these heathens, man, dropping dead, and I'm loving it. I'm loving it. What you got? Exodus chapter 14, verse 14. The Lord shall fight for you, and ye shall hold your peace. Sweat. Drop that. Give me Proverbs 18 and 10. Hold your peace, black man. You understand? Endure. Endure, black man. Endure, Hispanic man. Because guess what? The Lord is going to fight, and he's going to send his, the strongest thing you could ever imagine down here to fight for you. You just be ready when he sends that. You just be ready when he sends that major plague of plagues. You just be ready. Because Corona can get you too, black man. Corona can kill you too. It can. Don't play with the Lord. Don't play with the Lord. Whether you're his children or not, don't you ever play with the Lord, man. And the only way you're going to find out how to not play with him, how to not test him, how to not provoke him is by grabbing a fire. I'm going to say it all day long. You got that? Proverbs 18, verse 10. Uh -huh. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. Is a what? Strong tower. The name of the Lord is a what? The only place on the face of the earth that the Lord's name is in is in the ISUPK. You understand? And it says the Lord's name is a strong tower. Go ahead. The righteous run up into it. The righteous run up into it, man. And it's going to be a safe haven for black Hispanics and Hispanics. It is a safe haven for black Hispanics and Hispanics. It's a strong tower. You understand? The brothers in the troop in the ISUPK, we don't die to death. You understand that every Christian dies, man. Homosexuality don't thrive in here. That death don't come up in here, not that play. Do you understand? Drug addicts, you understand? We not, we not being drug addicts back here. We cut that out. You understand? We got so tired and so oppressed and so beat down. We wanted this corona so bad to come down and take care of our enemies so bad that we dropped the blunt. We wanted this so bad that we dropped the shrimp, crab, pork, and lobster, man. We wanted it so bad that we were willing to drop our entire way of life to follow this way of life, man. That's how bad we want it. And black citizens and Hispanics, you should want it that bad as well, man. The Lord is trying to show you something here. He's trying to show you something. Don't just take it as if, oh, you understand, is this another thing that America's plaguing with? Is this another thing, another day in the neighborhood? No, it's not. No, it's not. Don't get fooled. This coronavirus is not another day in the neighborhood, man. America is shaking. They understand. They quivering, having government uh, 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 meetings every single day, trying to figure out how they're going to handle this. No sweat. Keep walking around as if everything's fine. Everything's, uh, keep walking around like everything's fine, that you still trying to shake, you know what I'm saying, these heathens' hands. Black man, you better separate. If you ain't never wanted to listen to us before, you better listen to us now. Separate, let go of holding their hands, stop marrying that woman, do you understand? Stop doing these things with these heathens, man. Because the Lord is showing you 
how immune you are to this virus and how much he wants them to have it. But don't be mistaken. Don't be mistaken. He, you can also get it, black man. Do not provoke the most high. Drop that. Give me, uh, thir give me um, 30 and 5. Proverbs 30 and 5. We're going to get some more. It's a beautiful day. The sun is shining. Do you understand? America is dying. It's a beautiful day. Do you understand? Chinatown is turning upside down. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, ain't it? it hey, look, the bats can live now. Good night. The Asian restaurant's closing down. Uh, uh, Sharita is giving her money to the, to, the, to the sister that's trying to do her nails. I mean, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. You understand? America tried to take your neighborhood and you getting paid, come on, to stay home. That's a beautiful thing, man. That's a beautiful thing to the water to the most high once again. It's Negro paradise, con out of one con. It's Negro paradise. The most, <laughs> welcome to nigga heaven, man. No sweat. The Lord is bringing the neighborhood back together, ain't he? Won't he do it? <laughs> Won't he do it? Good night. Let's get back to the scripture. Proverbs chapter 30, verse 5. Every word of God is pure. It's absolutely pure. Everything we're trying to tell you is going to save you. It's going to protect you from this coronavirus. Go ahead. He is a shield unto them. He is a what? Shield unto them. The Most High's word is pure. Every single word that you can read in this Bible, every single word that the men of the ISBK are trying to tell you, it is absolutely pure and it's straight out of this Bible. And read the second part of the verse again. He is a shield unto them. And the Lord is going to be a shield. Once again, that's your mask, black man. That's your hand sanitizing the whole nine yards. He said he's going to be a shield. Following America, that's a glove. You understand? That's a dry fit. What is, it's a dry fit mask at that. I can breathe through it. If I got a mask on and I can still see my air come through it, it ain't saving me enough. But these words right here, the Lord said he is a shield. That's right. Good night. That's armor, armor. That's armor. That's a whole buckler. Do you understand? 